guys, welcome to Dean Luciano Fit. Thank you so much for showing up. I hope you're inviting your friends to do all these workouts too, because like, why not, right? We should all be having a good time. Okay, so listen, today is Fit Mat. I love this, love this. All right, we're gonna have 30 minutes. You'll need a band, a big, huge, long tube, and a ball that's rolling away. All right, and that's it. Okay, so this is um, this is gonna really shape that tush, shape your arms. We're just using our own body weight for this workout. Cool? Yes. Yes or yes, right? You have no option to say no, it's yes or yes. I always laugh, I tell my kids too, this is a dictatorship, not a democracy. Okay, so middle finger straight ahead. We're just gonna start off with some abdominal stretches, some back stretches, so you feel the front body really open up there on your exhale, you feel that back open up, and it feels so good. Yeah, love it. So thanks for showing up, you guys. I know that's the hardest part. I totally get it, right? Some days we just don't have it in us. But you know what? You're just going to kind of talk yourself into it, like be your biggest cheerleader, okay? Take that left leg back. Take that right arm up. And just hold this. Make sure that arm is parallel to the floor and right by your heater. Go ahead and float that leg up. Make sure you're dialing down your left pinky toes, okay? That'll help keep your hips square. Let's release this down and take it to the other side. So that left arm is coming up first, parallel to the floor and right by your ear. You gaze this toward the floor, take that leg back, dial down your pinky toes, hips are square, and release, okay? So we're just gonna kind of move with that on your inhale. Opposite leg and arm, take it down. Other side, opposite leg and arm, take it down. Couple more times, reach on that inhale, and as we breathe in, you want to think of creating length. So we're trying to touch both ends of the room. Nice. Keep it a nice long spine. One more time. And break. Beautiful. All right. Give me a little down dog here, guys. Just kind of shake this out just a bit. Press through those pads of your fingertips, okay? I know it's not like a total down dog, but I just want to kind of get those hamstrings nice and long. And you guys keep that head and neck lined up with your spine. I'll just go ahead and hurt my neck while I'm watching this, okay? Or at least like trying to talk to you. Wouldn't it be cool if we could all like be on the same page and like you could talk back to me and stuff like that? That's why you leave comments. All right, so we're gonna start off. First, I need a quick drink. Make sure you have your drinks with you too and a towel. We're gonna start off with a plank. Why? Because it's great for your entire body. All right, team, so we've got 30 minutes. Let's bang this out. Now listen, you're gonna get into a nice high plank. If you need the option of coming to your knees, that's fine. Just make sure you bring your hips with you and your booty's not being left behind, okay? So we're gonna hold this right here. I want you to think of drawing the eyes of your elbows forward. Squeeze your quads, pull your belly button to your spine. Really push the earth away from you. Now to get those quads to really activate, think of flexing them by pulling your kneecaps up into your hip bones. Feel that? Push down a little higher. Pull the shoulders away from your ears. Squeeze your bum. Oh, the entire front body's working. We're gonna be holding this for about 15 more seconds. Yeah, way well, yeah, up, so don't move. All right, here we go, team. Here's 10 seconds. Oh, that feels so good. Way to wake up that body. Yes, you can. Come on, flex those quads, belly tight. Three, two, and break. Beautiful, come down. Nice job. All right, so now we're taking it right down to the floor. We're gonna get into that back. Bringing your arms out by your sides. I'm gonna be facing the other way so you can see a little better on what's going on. Okay, so those arms are nice and long. They're lined up with your shoulders. We're gonna be bringing both arms up at the same time. Your top rib is on the floor. Your gaze is to the floor. Your glutes are tight. Always needing those glutes to be tight so we don't hurt our lower back. Point your toes, flex your quads, just like you did in that plank. Think of lifting your belly button up off the floor. Now, Yes, the arms move, but we're moving them with our back muscles. Think of squeezing your shoulder blades into your spine. So you're gonna keep going with that. All right, I'm gonna face you this way to just kind of show you what's going on, okay? Right here. Thumbs to the sky, pinkies to the earth. Glutes are super tight. So see where my gaze is? We don't wanna look here. We don't wanna be like this. And we don't wanna be like this. All right, so that top rib. Lengthen out those legs. Hug that spine. One more time, now hold it. Give me some pulses here. Get those arms nice and long. Nice and long. You're trying to touch both ends of the room. Can you squeeze those glutes tighter? Yes or yes. All right, pull that belly button up. Come on, nice and high. 
Thumbs to the sky, thumbs to the sky, get that pulse, reach for the walls for four. Navel up, three. How we feeling? We awake, or what? And break, nice. We're gonna come right back into a plank. Remember your option. You can take it to your knees. Hands are directly underneath your shoulders. Get those legs back one at a time. Feet are hip distance apart. We're holding right here. Push the earth away from you. Eyes of your elbows are spiraling forward. Right here, the eyes of your elbows spiraling forward, okay? This is gonna help to keep your chest open, shoulders back. You're planking, I'm talking. Listen, I talk, you work, all right? <laughs> Listen, so I just wanna make sure you're in good form one. I can't see you guys, so I need to like completely overcoach. Are we up here? Uh-uh, right here. Are we here? Uh-uh, hold, nice and tight, come on. Own it, own it. You showed up, you want the best workout you can get. Crown of your head, pushing to the front wall. Yeah, squeeze those quads nice and tight. Get that navel up into your spine. Pull those shoulders back. 10 more seconds, yes you can. So hold in here, guys. Get even stronger, push down harder. Let's go, let's go. For three, two, break. Awesome, come down. Right to your belly, that was awesome. Right to your belly, we're gonna back, get back into that back. This time we're pointing those toes, lifting our legs, squeezing those glutes nice and tight, and bringing our arms behind us. So thumbs to the floor, pinkies to the sky. Nice and strong, so yes, that top rib is still on the floor. Notice what we're not doing. We're not moving that torso, all right? Stabilize. You need your glutes tight to support that lower back. Now, no soft elbows. Get those arms really long, like you're trying to touch that wall. Do you guys remember that doll, Stretch Armstrong? All right, all my 70s friends out there that grew up in the 1970s, all right? So pretend like someone's behind you trying to pull your shoulders right back, keeping those arms nice and long, squeezing your bum. Crown your head is pressing to the front wall, belly button's pushed into your spine. We're going one more time now, ready? Up and pulse, let's go, eight, squeeze. Nice and strong, just those pinkies up. You're gonna feel this right down your back. These are all our posture muscles. Keep going, get longer. Last four, don't go anywhere. Stay right here, now hold, pulse it in, in, in. Yes, glutes tighter, quads tighter. Reach that back wall four, navel up three. How you doing? Last one, break. Awesome, did you feel that in your triceps? Yeah, because every time that arm is long, that triceps get nice and flexed. We're coming back up. We're done with the planks for now. We're going into our push-ups, okay? So listen, you want to get your hands a little wider than shoulder distance apart. If you need the option, take it to your knees. From the crown of your head to your tailbone is one straight line. All right, now for coaching, I'm going to just take it to my knees so I can kind of peek in on this. We inhale down, we exhale up. Don't worry, these are gonna get a little more challenging. Okay, keep those abs nice and tight. We're gonna go two more. We're gonna check our form. That's why they're gonna get a little tougher. All right, so come all the way down. I want your chest to hit the floor before your belly and hips. Lift your hands, press back up. Yeah, so it's a push-up release, okay? We're not gonna worry about the beat to the music. We're gonna take as many as we can. Oh man, that's a lot more challenging, huh? So we don't wanna do the worm and we don't wanna like come down and scoot, okay? You can cross your ankles and lift your feet if that helps you, but just make sure your body is in one straight line. Oh, how's that feel? These are challenging, but look what's happening. Your back is super straight, right? And we're not coming down like this. We're not coming up like this. All right, so let's go two more. Coming down, nice and strong. Last one, actually we have one more, last one. <laughs> Down, and press, go. Ah, fight, 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 fight. That was awesome. All right, you guys, we'll give that front body a break one more time. Let's take it to our belly. Yeah, yeah? Now, listen, arms are out, nice and strong. Belly up, gaze us to the floor. Arms are right by your ears, not our shoulders, right? So scoop those shoulders back, chop rib on the floor, just swim right there, like you're chopping your arms up and down. Glutes are wicked tight to support that lower back. 
Make sure those shoulders aren't hugged up by your ears, you guys. Nice long arms touching both ends of the room. Remember, stretch arms strong. Someone's trying to pull your hands and your feet away from your navel. So you're creating a lot of length there for four. Keep it tighter and quicker. Three. There's two. And break. All right, you guys ready to work now? <laughs> yeah, those are like our little warm-ups. You're gonna take that band, place it right around the outside of your thighs, above your knees. All right, make sure it's not on your kneecap. Bringing yourselves right down, be to flat. We're coming up and down. Now I always tell my little, I always tell my lady friends out there to make sure like you have a ponytail, like each side or on top, not on the nape of your neck, or not on the nape, uh, back of your head rather, because then it throws your alignment off. You know what I mean? So like, yeah, ditch the ponytail. I know like happy is the like, oh, she's talking to me. All right, so that's why I go with like right here so that your head and neck are lined up. Now, push those arms down into the earth. Toe heel those feet out of it. Let's make sure we're keeping a constant contraction with that outer thighs, okay? And those glutes, of course, take it up and pulse go right here. Drive through each corner of your feet, okay? So yeah, toes are trying to hug the mat. Most of our pressure is on those heels, but I don't want you doing this yet. All right, keep on pulsing. Now hold, push out, out, out. Where's the weight of your body? On your shoulder blades, right? No neck and throat. We've got eight. Hips higher. Yes, you can. Come on. Look how happy we feel. Up and down. Go lift. Lower. Boom. Now listen. Arms super straight. What happens when our arms are super straight? Anyone? Anyone? Feeler? <laughs> Those triceps fire up. Hold this impulse. Triceps fire up. So really focus on pushing your upper back, shoulders, triceps, palms, and forearms into the earth. See that? Oh yeah, now it's a body. Ready? Hold it up. Go. Pulse out, out, out. Ah. Oh. Glutes. Hips. Come on. Oh man. Isn't that great? Last four. My 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 body great anyways. Coming up and down. Right here. My version of great. You guys are like, no, that doesn't feel great. It really hurts. But listen, with that said, we don't go for pain. It's discomfort, so you're uncomfortable, not in pain. Toe heel those feet out wider. Hold it out. Pulse. Pulse. Make sure those knees are tracking your toes. Glutes are nice and tight. Where's your arms? Flat, straight, press, press. Now because we told toe heeled our feet out a little wider, this is gonna be a little harder. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Keep those hips up. So our tension goes from tight to tighter. Right, not loose. Tight, tighter, tight, tighter. Keep pulsing here for four, for three, two, and break. Oh, that felt good. Ditch that band. Awesome job. We're gonna get into our inner thighs and into some core work. Now remember this class is 30 minutes, so I'm gonna to try to bang out as much as we can in 30 minutes, okay? Right here, we're coming down for two, and exhaling up two, I'm gonna back up. Inhaling down, exhaling up. My friends that have a bad back, or if you're pregnant, one foot at a time, so don't even use a ball, okay? Everyone else, we're squeezing those inner thighs. We're coming down as low as we can without arching our back. Take those hands and karate chop them. Karate chop, okay? Now, squeeze that ball tight up. Really point those toes. You're touching the wall in front of you. You're looking at the sky. Ah, looking good for two. Feel your belly. Now ready, we're gonna hold this as low as you can without arching. Bring it up and down just an inch, just an inch, or like three inches. Squeeze that ball tight up. Go ahead and peel your head, neck, and shoulder blades off the floor. You're looking over your belly through your legs. If this bothers your neck, keep it down. Go two up all the way. Two up, two down. Nice. Squeeze, release. Let's go two more. Feel good? Can you get up higher? Rib cage down and together. Now ready, hold it. Few inches up and down. You're getting to your edge. So you're coming down as low as you can and reaching up just a few inches, okay? So no lower than your edge, which mine is right here. Last two, ready, all the way up, go. Two counts, down two. Ah, that feels good. Isn't it great too when you feel stronger? It's like, it makes you feel proud. 
Well, it should make you feel proud. Showing up should make you feel proud. Four more times. You're looking over that belly, over your thighs. How tight can you squeeze that ball? Can you squeeze it tighter? Huh? Yeah, I know you can. Come on, get those shoulder blades off the floor. Hold this right here, let's go. Up and down, remember, just a few inches. We don't go lower from our edge. Right there, go squeeze tighter, tighter, tighter. Three, feeling good. Two, and break. Take it in, awesome job. While we're here, we're gonna stand on that ball. Option one, just keep both feet on the floor. You can take the ball between your legs. We're going into bridges. This is gonna feel a lot different though. All right, because we don't have the tension on our outer thighs. Now, right here is where I'd kind of like you to be because we're balancing, so we're working our core. All right, monkey feet on the balls. Monkey feet on the balls, so you're hugging those balls, right, with the arch of your foot. Toes are grabbing it, heels are grabbing it. Breathing out, breathing in. So my friends at home, with just the ball between your legs, this is good stuff, you guys. Everyone's working wicked hot. Even if you don't have the ball, take this up, pulse. Right here, push down into that ball. Where your arms at? Come on. Squeeze nice and tight. Boom. Navel drawn down, rib cage. Get those hips, rib cage down and together. Hold it. You want more balance? I can hear you shouting yes. So right here, ready? Second set, let's go. We're down and up. Now clearly, if you're on top of the ball, you're not coming down all the way. All right, let's go. But we need to really push those shoulders back, right? Find a focal point. So I'm not gonna look at you anymore. If I look at you, I'm gonna fall. <laughs> I already have a fit box class that I completely fell. It was hysterical. Hold this, pulse it. So you gotta laugh at yourself, right? You can't take yourself too seriously. And with that said, you guys know I keep my workouts wicked serious, like I'm totally into your health and wellness, but like I just laugh at myself all day. Tempo up and down. Because when you don't laugh, you cry, right? So we're not only making this body stronger, we're empowering ourselves with a lot of mental strength. Take it up, hold, last set, go, go. Ow, nice and tight, yes sir, yes. Can we get higher? Yeah, I thought you could. Come on, shoulders down, hips up, three, two, and break. Beautiful, let's flush that away again. Remember, bad backs, one foot on the floor. Grab that ball between your inner thighs. Bend those knees on your inhale from your hips. Tap your toes, pull your knees over your hips. Look what we're not doing. Watch me for a minute. We're not doing this to touch the floor. All right, knee joint doesn't move from your hip. Knees above your hips. Arms overhead. Arms peel up. Breathe in as you lower. Out as we pull. Nice. I'm just gonna scooch. Keep going. Breathing in as we lower. Out as we pull. Nice job, right? Stay right here. Give me some hundreds. Go. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Fingertips reach the front wall. Bad necks. Place one hand behind your head. Can you squeeze a little tighter? Yeah, sometimes we forget. That's why I completely overcoach. Keep reaching, come on. Peel those shoulder blades off the floor. Rib cage down and together. Strong arms, long arms. Where are you feeling it? Triceps. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Come on, a little higher, a little higher. Yes, you can. We're going eight more, seven more, six. <sighs> nice. Now, break. Inhale, come down to. Exhale, come up to. One more time, okay, neck on a break. Take this right up, let's go, inhale, arms up head. Feel the stretch, exhale, and lift. Now, what we're gonna do, keeping your knees over your heels, we're just gonna kind of cross to the left, to the right. Squeeze that ball tight, your hips are not coming up off the floor. Go right arm, go left arm, all right? So you can take those triceps and push them down on the floor if you don't wanna do two arms at the same time. Just look at me, make sure those shoulder blades come off the floor. Right, we're not just twisting side to side. You gotta twist and reach, twist and reach. Like you're trying to get that arm bit to touch your knee. Squeeze that ball harder. You can go both arms. Little more twist and balance, right? I'm gonna stay one, because I keep looking at you. This is eight. Reach, touch that ball in front of you. For four, three, two, break. Awesome, come on up. Take that ball. Remember we've been like twerking, you guys can 
been like practicing the twerk. I hope so. <laughs> We're bringing it back. All right, so abs nice and tight, dig those heels. So look at behind your sit bones, your shoulders and hips are in one straight line. We're gonna kayak right here. All right, so grab your oars and row. Yeah, so it's really like, obviously we're not going anywhere, guys, okay? What I want you to do, chest to the front wall, chest to the back wall, all right? Get the rotation in that waist. If you need to readjust, back up. Just that lean back is already wicked tight, isn't it? Yeah, so like if someone came and kicked you, they break their foot. <laughs> Use your breath, breathe out, breathe in. Keep the contraction, ears, shoulders, hips, one straight line, get that rotation. Oh, that's feeling good in a really uncomfortable way. Come on, row it nice. Let's go one more time and break. Oh, that felt good, ditch your ball. Grab your long tube. Place it around the arch of your feet. And if your feet are like wicked sensitive, just get a towel and plate on your socks or your sneakers. All right, cross this. We're gonna be working on back. You might have to, you know, choke up, okay? I'm gonna choke up a little more. So we're going with a little back row right here. We're sitting tall on our sit bones, we're looking straight ahead. We get a cup of coffee on top of our head. Shoulder blades are drawn down and together. Isn't that cool? Boom, all our posture muscles. So when we were on our belly, kind of warming up, we hit our back with those T shapes, right? Because we're squeezing our shoulder blades into our spine. <laughs> now we're really feeling a little more resistance, okay? So those palms drive into your waist, elbows back to the wall behind you. Let's go one more time. Now, pulse it go. Eight, seven, six, keep pulling, keep pulling. Sit up taller, oh yeah. Come on, so even though we're pulling back, shoulder blades are drawn down and together. Here's four, three, two, one, and break. Beautiful. So you know what this is gonna mean. We just worked our back, we're gonna go back into our chest. Yeah, thank God. You guys are like, woohoo! More push-ups on those knees. Cross your ankles, lift your feet, go down, tempo, right here. All right, so those abs are super tight. Now my friends, if you can go to your toes, that's totally cool. Like I said, for coaching purposes, I stay on my knees, because I gotta be able to talk to you. I need my breath. You guys should be kind of getting out of breath just a little bit, but like in a good way. Not in like, oh my God, I'm jumping up and down, running around the way, okay? <laughs> one more time, actually one more, one more time, one more time, and great. Awesome, we're gonna go back to that back, grab you down. Yeah, look how much we can accomplish in 30 minutes, right? We don't waste time. We're busy people. Choke up. We're gonna keep those arms up. I'm gonna face you guys the other way though, just to show you, okay? Keep going. So it's a little high row. So arms right here, and those elbows about shoulder height, okay? So pretend like you're sitting up against a wall, and you wanna press your triceps to the back wall. Big squeeze. You got it? I'm gonna face you sideways. Actually, I'll stay like this. I'll just talk to you. How's everybody doing? Don't you feel good? Are we in? We're 22 minutes in. Ready, pulse it, go. Look at that. We're almost done. Can you sit up tall up? Soft knees. Yes sir, yes. Let's go, let's go. Shoulder blades down and together. Not getting tired, getting stronger. Three, two, one, hold it, don't move, four. Yes. Pull back a little harder. Ah, now it's like wicked uncomfortable. Get a little harder. Oh, now it's like wicked piss up uncomfortable. Pulse it here, three, two, break. Oh, great job. Awesome, you feel good, I know you do. Cross those feet, if that's not comfortable, just keep one leg out. We're gonna take these into my, are you there, God? It's me, Margaret, book from seventh grade. We must, we must, we must increase our bust, okay? So those, <laughs> I know you know, I know you know that book. All right, I know everyone was at home doing this at one point too. Sit up nice and tall. Elbow, shoulder, height, flex that, flex your pecs, boom, flex your chest, boom, yeah. You want more? Yeah, is that what I heard? Then choke up. Four more, yeah, come on. <sighs> right here, team. Two, get those arms touching. Now little pulses, eight, seven, come on. Right here, sit tall, sit tall, elbow, shoulder, height. Now remember, the arms are moving, but we're trying to really squeeze those pecs. Feels good, right? Is three, two, one, nice. 
just kind of loosen up a bit, just a bit, not much. Get those arms up nice and straight. That band's underneath your armpits, going across. Right over left, left over right. Get tall on your sit bones, awesome. Ready, now chop over. Touch the wall in front of you. Arms are nice and long. Doesn't that feel good? Feel your shoulders, feel your pecs. Yes, yes, four more. Awesome, cross it. Open, cross. Can you try to choke up a little more? Huh? I'll choke up with you, come on. Cross it, open. Last two, ready, chop it. Boom, boom, boom. Sit tall on those sit bones. So we get a cup of coffee on top of our head so we don't wanna <laughs> spill it, right? Fingertips to the front wall, shoulder blades run down and back foot four, but three, two, and break. Beautiful, come on up, take your ball with you. Why not? Let's get those inner thighs working. We're gonna hit our biceps. Bands on the out to your feet. I kinda like to um, cross it so it doesn't come flinging out. So squeeze that ball, up two, down two. Stand tall, up two, squeeze your bum. Coffee on top of your head. Boom, keep those elbows close to your side and look what you're not doing. We're not moving those shoulders. We're not, <clears throat> come on. Two up, two down. We're gonna be taking this tempo. Can you get your feet a little closer? Only to squeeze your bum tighter, all right? And fire up those inner thighs. Hold here. Right, left, let's go. Pull, pull, nice. Glutes tight, no shaking, no shimmering. <laughs> Very last four. So if you're starting to like, uh, all right, maybe step off one foot, okay? Both arms, two pounds, up two, down two. Make sure you're even, arm across. Up two, down two, stay with it. I always have like a blooper and blunda, a blooper? Yeah, blooper, blooper wheels. <laughs> Come on, up two, down two. I don't care, like I said, I laugh at myself. Up two, and really make sure you're flexing. You're not squeezing those handles for dear life. All right, you're flexing those biceps. Now ready? Hold it halfway and pulse eight, seven. Stand tall, squeeze your bum. Three, two, one, and break. Gently, release, hold, right here, elbows forward, press, right here. Triceps, okay, so this way. Press out, see you're choked up. You want those arms like you're trying to bang the wall with your pinky, there's a little bit of an angle. You're looking straight ahead, squeeze that ball tight and zip up those glutes. Remember, we're opening up our hips now, so check it. Ready? Bottom arm, we're going up and down. Just make sure when you come down, it's not loose like this, okay? So make sure you are choked up. So it's tight, tighter, tight, tighter, tight. How are you doing? How are you doing? Good, good. Yes, yes, you showed up. So proud of yourselves. Ready, hold and pulse, eight, seven, both arms nice and strong, nice and long, squeeze your bum, squeeze your bum. Tempo, up, down, go for four, yes, squeeze. Last two, oh man, other arm go, come on. Hang on, get back, choke up, go. Lift and lower. Make sure you're choked up enough. What's gonna happen if we're not choked up enough? You're not gonna be working hard enough. We want to get uncomfortable, not in pain. We got four more. Squeeze the ball tighter. Suck your glutes in tighter, like you get a dollar bill into your butt cheeks. Don't let the dollar bill go. Now ready? Both arms. Yeah. Press. Love it. Boom. Your, right, your bottom arm now is like, yeah, hey, how do you like it now up there? Right? Come on. Squeeze. Oh. Can we get that ball squeezed a little tighter? I think you can. Last two and break, beautiful. Ditch that band, you guys did awesome. Come on down, oh no, you're not done. Uh-uh, come on down, all fours. Take that ball behind one leg, hands under your shoulders, and we're going with pulses. Squeeze that ball tight. Right here, right here, short pulses. Look at under this clap, okay? Keep that head and neck parallel to the floor. I mean, yeah, no, that's right. Head and neck and spine. One straight line, keep on going, eight, seven. Squeeze that ball nice and tight. We're going four, three, two. Listen, can you get into a plank? You wanna try? Ready? Pulse, pulse, come on. All in your bum, not your lower back. Abs super tight. 
oh, those glutes down, huh? Push down a little harder. For four, keep pulsing. For three, keep pulling that heel to your bum. And break, beautiful. Other side, team fit mat. We've got about a minute and a half. Look at you guys. How awesome are you feeling though, huh? Now ready? Right here, just pulse, just pulse, that's all. Yeah, that's it. We did a lot of glute work on our back, didn't we? Whether or not you have the ball between your legs, whether or not you're balancing on the ball, even if you don't have a ball, you can completely do this workout. Now, you wanna try the plank? Okay, now remember, we work to the point of discomfort, not pain. Everything right now is in that glute, not your lower back. Push through the earth, get the sole of your foot to the sky, the heel to your bum. One more set, keep pulsing. Eight, seven, come on. Come on, four, three, two, and break. How good do you feel? 30 minutes, look at that. Imagine this for an hour. Yeah, I'm gonna be offering it for an hour. You guys did awesome and I want you to be proud of yourselves. Let's get some stretches in real quick. All right, so let's get the inner thigh stretch. Okay, because we squeeze that ball a lot. We never want to force a stretch. And we also don't want to bounce in the stretch. So you're coming down as far as you can. You're going to notice the more you breathe out, the more flexibility you'll create. Keep your stretch active by pulling your toes toward you. You want your feet flexed. So here's your nice and the thigh stretch. We're going to bring it up just for timing purposes. Take that left ankle to your thigh, right foot to the floor. Sit up nice and tall, okay? So none of this. You want to try to press that left knee away and pull that right leg toward you. Tall. Always tall and proud. Release it out on the side. Ankle to thigh. Flex that foot. Ah, that feel good. Right through those hips and glutes. So remember you guys, I offer stretch workouts as well. 15 minutes and a half hour. All right? So if you want a little more, go click on my fit stretch. All right, these are just like basic little stretches. I want the workout to be the full half hour. Take this up, out in front, round out that back. Scoop those arms behind you. Lift your chest, open your heart. Hello, positive vibes. Take them all in, you guys did awesome. Thank you so much. Remember my social media, Dina Matrano Fit. Everything's Dina Matrano Fit. Instagram, Facebook, dinamatranofit.com, website, YouTube. Dina Matrano Fit. <laughs> Good guess. All right, so invite your friends. Please subscribe to my channel. I'd totally appreciate it. And I will see you soon. All right, you guys. Bye.